with Fatu. Fatu's looking to buy her first car. So we're here at Audi, yes. and Audi is a good manufacturer, and we're looking at the A1 and the mm. A3. So the A1's slightly smaller than what you've been driving yeah. on your lessons, and the A3 is probably more or less the same size of the vehicle that yeah. you're looking for. Now, as your first car, you're looking for something actually with four doors or five doors, five aren't doors, you? Yeah. yeah. And we're looking to do it on a higher sort of agreement, so PCP. Um, yeah. So you'll do the, the low monthly payments, mm -hmm. at the end you'll have the option of trying to buy the car. Yeah. Yeah. So let's go have a look at what you're interested in. So we've got the A3 here. So this is quite a nice car. Well, what is it exactly that you want from your first car? So it needs to be reliable. Right. So uh, I work long hours and I work full time, so I need a car to get me to and from work. Um, and it has to last me for quite a long time, which is why I'm looking at newer cars. Good. Because um, in the long run, it will yeah. benefit me. Okay. It also has to be quite spacious because mm -hmm. I do have a big family and I've got good close friends, a good group of friends. So it needs to be good enough, big enough for shopping trips, nights out, days out, that sort of thing. Okay, so nice I'm boot space as well. Definitely big yeah. boot space um, and a nice bit of space in the back. Lovely. Um, automatic transmission. Okay, technology. Do you want anything like yes. features for reverse parking cameras, sensors? Yeah, definitely parking You do? Sensors, okay, all right. Because a few of these cars actually have it. So let's go have a look over at the A1. So if you just join us, we're just going to take a little walk over to the A1. So what is it that we're looking at? So we're looking at the boot space. The boot right. space is actually really decent and you can fold the seats down as well. Let's have a look. Good. So we've got foldable seats here, quite a large yeah. space, that's nice. Love it, and there's also parking sensors on the back. Okay, so we've got parking sensors. We've got the Just camera there. here. Yeah. Just there, obviously. And the um, colour. Can't yeah, get over how beautiful the colour is. Very good. It's yeah. a unique colour. I like Absolutely it. Absolutely love um, it. What's nice about this for the city is the yeah. suspension's been raised, so that's why they call this version the City Carver. Mm -hmm. The monthly payments will be probably about three hundred and fifty. I yeah. reckon something like that. Yeah. And you're probably looking at about two grand deposit. Yeah. On your PCP payment. Yeah, so exactly. how does that strike you? Is that something that could definitely interest you? Definitely I can, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I would encourage people to go down this route of going to a dealer. Yeah. Um, because if you have any further questions or, you know, your card's covered by warranty as well. So you yeah, can always exactly. come back to the dealer and you've got that security yeah, as well. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, lovely. All right, so let's go have a little look at some other cards. Two. Everybody joins us here at Volkswagen yeah. now. So this was the car that you actually looked at before we came to look for your first car yeah. together. Yeah. So this one is a Volkswagen Polo. Now this is brand new, so we're talking 2020. Yeah. It's actually a thousand pound cheaper than the Audi um, City, yeah. what's it called? The City, City Carver. That's the one, yeah. <laughs> so it's a thousand pound cheaper and the City Carver was actually used. It was. Um, the interiors are relatively simple, but yet you don't get all the added features that you got on no, the other one. No, so we don't get a rear camera. Um, I don't think we get parking sensors. I'm not sure. No, I doubt do. you get parking sensors. I don't yeah. see them on this. So this is pretty basic. Yeah. I mean, you could probably get the extras, which I think is going to add nearly two grand to this vehicle. Yeah. So you'd be looking at a grand more expensive if you did want those exactly. as uh, compared to the Audi that we looked at. Mm -hmm. Now, what do you think of your boot space? here love the boot space there's yeah. so much space in the boot so you've got your five door on this which is what you were looking for uh the leg space let's have a look not a lot it's of leg right. space so right. you're gonna have to have five-year-olds in the back if you want um yeah. anyone to have comfort which seems to be quite normal in vehicles like this yeah. now what is your verdict would you go for the audi or would you go for the volkswagen I would definitely go for the Audi. And why? More quality. So okay. You can tell the difference in quality with the Audi, and you get more for your money, if that makes sense. Yeah, so I guess. Very similar in price, mm. but 
I get parking sensors, mm. the interiors, so much more nicer, mm. although it is really nice in there, but how do you win it? Yeah, so it is quite nice. Um, and I guess the pricing would probably be the same as well, yeah. so your monthly payment should be very similar. Yeah. All right, so I think this is a good little guide to buying a car new or used yeah. from a dealership and sort of pricing that you'll be looking at so again you're going to be looking at around 300 per month yeah. towards the 400 if you had all the added extras mm -hmm. okay so uh, i hope that's been helpful thank you Scott. and if it has please give fatu a thumbs up and uh, we might have some more videos on <laughs> buying your first car yeah. all right Thanks, see you later guys. bye